All right, now we're doing 8Q, Sum of Differences in Array. This is by Camila Liu, and 90% of the people like it. Our task is to sum the differences between consecutive pairs in the array in descending order. For example, here's an array, make it descending, All right? So put the 10 here, and the one here, and the two here, descending order. And then one minus two plus two minus one, equals 8 plus 1, which equals 9, right? Ah, ha, ha, ha. This one's a joker, right? See, as you can see here, these two cancel each other out. And if there was a million odd numbers, you know, no matter what, these ones would cancel. Everything between the first one and the last one would cancel each other out. Okay, hopefully that makes sense to you. Uh, I'm not just going to... Hopefully that makes sense to you. I hope that makes sense to you. So what we're really getting at here is... Let's imagine all that's gone. Okay, it's 10 minus 1, which equals 9. Okay? So that's the, that's the little trick to it. So if that's the case, all we got to do is some easy stuff. And what that is, after we set up here is using a little bit of this uh, math.max, right? But the other thing is, what if it, what if there's no, what if there's nothing in there, right? Uh, what if there's no, uh, what am I trying to say? What if, what if there's no numbers in the array, and then it's just zero? So that's why we're gonna do a ternary operation with it too. So as long as r.length is greater than one, we're going to say, math oops let me show you math.max is math.max function returns the largest of the zero or more numbers given as input parameters or nan if any parameter isn't a number and can't be converted into one so because of this nan thing that's why we got to do that uh, zero, this this action here so we're going to do math. Dot, oops math.max and then as you can see here if you got an array, you put dot, dot, dot in front of the array. So I'm going to say dot, 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 r, all right, minus math dot, math dot min. Oops, I forgot to bust out the math dot min. Here it is. And it's the same thing, but low, the lowest number. So uh, math dot min dot, 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 r. And that should give us what we want. And if there, if this thing doesn't have anything in the array, zero, just like that. Let's test it out. Looks good. Attempt it. Looks good. Submit it. Great. My solutions. One, two, three of us. Best practice in my opinion. Very like it. And we'll see you next time.